Hey everyone, I'm Paul, and today I'll show you how to change the engine oil and transmission gear oil in your Chinese scooter. I recommend changing the oil in your scooter at least once per year. If you ride a lot, changing the engine oil every 1,000 miles is a good idea. The gear oil sits in the back of the scooter and doesn't get hot, so it lasts a lot longer. You can change it every other oil change, or just do them together to keep things simple. Air-cooled engines like the GY6 don't control their temperature as well as a liquid-cooled engine, so synthetic oil for motorcycles is a good idea. Walmart has good oil for cheap. The oil drain plug is on the left side of the scooter and takes a 17mm socket. If you just bought an old scooter like I did, start by changing the oil. You don't know how old that oil is or if it's contaminated, so just change it. Check to see if the oil smells like gas or if it has metal chunks or sparkles in it. This oil doesn't look too bad. Make sure you have your drain plug washer and reinstall the drain plug. You don't actually need a torque wrench for this. The torque specs are for the nerds out there. On the right side of the scooter, you'll find another plug under the engine. This is the oil screen. It's like a filter, but only catches big chunks. Clean it out and add a little bit of grease or oil to the O-ring. Stack the small end of the spring into the plug, then put the screen inside it. Push the cap, spring, and screen straight up as you turn it clockwise. Use a 17mm socket to tighten the plug. Use a skinny funnel to fill the oil through the dipstick tube. Most Chinese scooters take about 3 quarters of a quart of oil. Reinstall the dipstick and run the engine for a few seconds. Turn the engine off and let it sit for at least 30 seconds to let the oil drain back down. Set the scooter on the center stand or hold it straight up and down. Wipe off the dipstick and insert it into the engine. Don't thread it in. The oil level should be close to the top of the skinny part of the dipstick. Overfilling it can cause oil to get into the intake and the carburetor through the PCV system. The final drive gears at the back of the transmission have oil too. It's just gear oil and there's not very much. Reinstall the drain plug and washer. It doesn't need to be very tight. The fill plug is right here on the side of the transmission. Insert the tip of the gear oil bottle into the hole and hold the scooter by the handlebars as you lean it over. It only needs 0.12 liters of gear oil. Two big squeezes on the bottle should be enough. This scooter doesn't have a center stand, so I put a block of wood under the kickstand to make it sit straight up and down. If you overfilled the gear oil, the extra oil will just come back out. When the stream of oil turns into a drip, make sure you don't lose the washer and reinstall the fill plug. Tighten it to 10 foot pounds or 14 newton meters. Thanks for watching and remember to check out my Chinese scooter playlist. See you next time.